<clears throat> my own personal belief is that it is intelligent. It's a plant teacher, and it's it's it, it's getting out to so many people because it's it's ayahuasca's agenda, not so much ours. It is ours, but we shouldn't <clears throat> you know we shouldn't delude ourselves that we're we're in control. I really think that that ayahuasca is running the show. It reminds me of that every time I take it, and it's kind of obvious. You know, it is running the show, uh, and uh, it. This is happening because it wants it to happen. But plants, uh, you know, what they basically want to do is spread, and they want to reach into new environments. And for a plant, and I really do believe that the relationship with humans and ayahuasca is a symbiosis. Right, and uh, it's to the plant's advantage to have this symbiosis with these primates because it means that it has an evolutionary free ride for a while. You know, people will cultivate it, people will spread it, people will you know, do all the things they do, and that's good from the point of view of ayahuasca, you know. Um, I sometimes say ayahuasca is a liquid. It's going to fill any hollow, any niche that it can find. You know, ayahuasca, like any drug, like any technology, is just, uh, it's morally neutral. The morality comes from us. The morality comes from within the human heart. <laughs> Vai, <laughs> 